Hi again, Brian here at the Espressive booth at Embedded World 2025, and I'm here with my friend Anam Gupta. Uh, hi Brian, how are you? I'm great, thanks. Uh, last time we did a webinar was on the P4, and I've just had a look here. I had to squeeze in because it's really busy and it's the third day and it's still hard to get a spot there. So the products are really exciting and there's a whole host of, of processes and things going. So you guys are c continuing to develop? Yeah, for sure, right? So P4 has been very popular to, uh, in this show, right? We have a lot of use cases showing uh, their HMI capabilities. We have a lot of GUI frameworks from different uh, partners. We have some MIPI to HDMI bridge. So the TVs there are also being powered by the P4. Uh, then we have a lot of uh, demos on the C5, especially on the C5 Wi-Fi sensing capabilities. A uh, lot of interest uh, because it's a different use case, uh, so a lot of interest there. Uh, then we also have the H21 or the H4 demo, which is showing our ultra low power use cases. We have the complete matter ecosystem demo, which we are showcasing here. So yeah, overall we have a lot of things, a lot of interest, people are very I would say excited about all these new products and yeah. And I see a lot of people uh, milling around the C5 and C6. How are those going? Yeah, definitely, right? So connectivity is our DNA, I would say, right? So yeah, so there's a lot of huge interest in C5 and C6. A lot of customers already building products with C6. A uh, lot of developers trying to know when the C5 will be out, when they can grab their hands to it so they have their project there so we have a lot of interest on those series as well yeah well that's great I'm, i mean i see a lot of industrial stuff but i also see a lot of fun stuff going on little ai yeah so we have a like couple of fun robots made on the s3 which can dance based on the open ai uh, sdk so we have a couple of demos with the c5 and the s3 where we do the integration of the open ai embedded sdk so you can talk in any language what you want and then you can control a robot or ask it as to be a chatbot or an assistant. Yeah. yeah, and I've had some fun looking at all of that and I'm itching to get my hands on some of those tiny... <laughs> Great. Um, I was going to ask you how the show is going, but judging by this, uh, I already know it's going well, right? Oh yes, it's as always, super busy, super enthusiastic uh, crowd always love to meet people who are excited about it, some who complain about it but it's always good to get feedback improve on it but yeah most of the times people are very happy with it so feels proud and there are some colleagues who are new to embedded world and they really see okay when people come and say they love our products it really feels good to work on something which people cherish and people want to build on top of that right so, yeah. Well, that's awesome. Uh, I know you're tired. It's the third day, but thanks for joining us, Anand Gupta from Espressive. Thank you. Thank you, Brian, for stopping by. It's always a pleasure talking to you. Thank you. So much. You too. Yeah.